Hello guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to fix your account does not meet the following requirements in order to play. HeVCI enabled uh, and I will show you how to solve it because I had a problem as well with Valorant myself. So we first click on the Windows button and with the R and then this will show up and we type in just like I see right here MS Info 32 and we will click on OK. And then you will find uh, this uh, page. As you can see, system information. It is in Dutch, I'm sorry. But uh, you can do the same thing, uh, actually the same steps in English. So uh, here's the system. And then we will scroll all the way down and here it says Hyper-V. Make sure these four are all on yes and uh, these are all on yes and then you're good to go then we go to the next step then we will click on your settings so let me find them so here we are going to the settings and here it is uh, in the settings we go to privacy and security so here are at the top windows security and we will click on it and here is some uh, info, some uh, security areas and we will need the device security. So we click on it right here and it will open up another window. And here we have to go to the core isolation. So as you can see right here and you click on core isolation details. And here it is, this is turned off, but we have to turn this one actually on. So you have to enable this one to fix it. Uh, so that's a step and click on yes. As you can see for now, my disk I have to update, but what you have to do uh, is turn this one on and then you have to restart your computer, otherwise it won't work. So then we will go to the next step. Once this one is on on my PC, it's not working right now because I are a old disk but you have to restart it and then go back to windows then you have to add to the search bar gp edit will not pop up on my pc because it's older but this will show you uh, the computer configuration screen and you have to click on computer configuration then administrative templates and then system then click on device card and from here on, turn on virtualization based security. And click on enable and apply. And this is actually how to fix it. Um, so if you have done all the steps right, you could play again uh, Valorant. So thank you for watching.